This is still in my backpack. Seriously, that would suck to be stuck like as a termite or something. It's cute, but all I can do is jump and go in tiny places, so it's like... What's the point? Look at it, it's so adorable. Oh my gosh, I love it. Freaking, like, presses those legs down with such force. It's too bad it doesn't have, like, an, an actual move to attack with and stuff. Where'd you get those shorts? We don't even have shorts on! All we got is the backpack, and that was a terrible job. Do I, do I have shorts? Do I have shorts? Actually, I see, because I see the buckle. Oh, he totally does have shorts on! Oh my gosh! This termite has shorts on! Why? That is so stupid and unnecessary. I love it. Oh, that was a terrible last jump. Man, I cannot platform today. Let's try this again. Jumping. Let's jump again. Jump again. And okay, seriously? The angles. The freaking angles. Like, that camera, it, like, changes angles the last second, and then it makes me face completely the wrong way, and it really throws me off. Gotcha. Frick, I cannot play. You're not getting the backpack, buddy. It's my backpack. I am three notes away from being done here. I think I'm seriously missing the three... <sighs> Frick! Why did that take so long? Holy crap! Cannot platform from to save my life! Good. Up. Thank you. <laughs> Ugh, perfect, I made it. And at the top we have an extra life. And if I fall, I would be so pissed. Let's get that. Let's get our jiggy. And then we just have one more set of notes to find. That was smart, by the way. Just to jump all the way down. Okay, so let's see. I know the draw distance kind of here kind of sucks, but I want to check the notes. Oh, there we go. Yeah, there were three notes that I missed. Okay. And we're done. Perfect. Yeah, I know. I'm so impressed with bottles. Please, pat my back. What happens if I fall in the water as a termite? How bad would that be? I bet he just, like, doesn't swim. He just kind of, like, sinks to the bottom and keeps walking. Let's see. just want to confirm this. Oh, yeah, it totally does. I knew it. I knew it. And I think that's actually, well, I mean, other than that one empty honeycomb piece, let's actually check our totals here. What am I missing? Yep, the one. Okay, and I can come back and get that in a bit. So, get here, get out, and then we head back in. Yeah, I, I, I know that. I just collected counts as your best note score. Try to get 100 on each world as they are the need are needed to open the note doors. You got it. Bottles now waits for Mumbo's magic to wear off. Oh no, animal turn back or magic go. I love that ellipses at the end. He's like so upset by it. Or magic go, no. Oh, back to boring old barren bird now. How upsetting. What the? How do I get up there? That's the real question. Oh, that's right. I need to be the termite. Ah. You idiot! You idiot! Man, I am just on a roll today. Gosh, okay. Frick. So I messed that up, but don't worry. Always head back up to the top. Still need to get that empty honeycomb piece anyway. And I just can do the quick transformation, right? Or do I have to collect all the frickin' tokens again? I think I might have to. Okay, that one. Perfect. Excuse me, I need to get up on top of your head, sir. Perfect. And there we go. Yeah, we don't need to click the tokens again. There is that. Awesome. So now, let's quickly do the transformation thing. Transform me. Trans transform. Thank you. Good sir. This freaking chant when he does it too. It's like, what the frick, man? What does that even mean? Go down. Yeah. Woo. 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 So adorable. My goodness, it's almost too hard to handle. There we go, up here. And perfect. There we go. Now we head it back up. 
Excuse me. Get up here. Get the jigsaw. Okay, now we can leave. We got two in the overworld. We got all the ones we need in the main world. Yeah. When you open a world door, Maddie's escape. And roam once more. Okay, thank. Thank, uh, Grunty. Alright, now, Talon trot our way up this hill and get to the next area. Which I believe Treasure Trove Cove is next. Isn't that, isn't that right? I think it is. No door. Bottles, what do you need now? Okay, thank you. With one of her powerful musical spells. She's musically inclined? Wow. That's actually slightly impressive. You need a thousand! The number on the door is the strength of the spell. Find total of all your best note scores from the world must be at least this to break Grunty's magic. Think. And the magic is broken! And we're so happy we decided to do a little dig. Okay. Okay. You know what? Shut up. Just don't don't say words. In fact, we're gonna go open up Judge Trove Cove now. We need freaking two jiggies to get. I have a little more than that. Why would I do that? Okay, why would I even want to take them out in the first place? That's kind of dumb. I want to open every world. Why would you? Who would not want to open the world? In fact, you'd, you'd practically have to. That's stupid. Okay, anyway. Let's go this way. I wonder if you can beat this game without opening a certain world. <laughs> Either way. Let's see. Where are we going? Where are we going? We're going here. Oh, hi. Owned. Uh, are we oh, it's Dingpot! You've activated a magic cauldron. Find two the same color to create a shortcut. Yeah! Okay, kinda need that. Alright. Now, let's drop back down. Head this way. And swim a little bit. Okay, get across. Oh, no, no, sir! I was not prepared for that. Rude. Excuse me, I need you. I need you. Oh, please. Perfect. Alright, note door that I cannot open. Alright, let's see. Now, is. Okay, I'm trying to remember where the freak is Treasure Trove Cove. Is it down here? I think it is. Yes, it is. Totally. And in we go. Okay. I freaking love this level. Even though I don't know it as well, I still love it. Such awesome music. Give me all these notes. And now let's get that Jinjo. Here we go. Perfect. So bad. Oh, hello, Snacker. Freaking shark guy that tries to kill everybody. He's rude. And stomach punch. Actually, it's more like stomach, like skewer. That's just nasty. Why would you do such a thing? That's horrible. It's horrific. Let's go fight the crab guy because he's really cool. Except for he's not. He's just a bad guy. I forget his name. It's like Naber or Knacker or something like that. Oh, actually, I don't even know. I didn't even get to read it, so I just skipped it. That was dumb. Owned. Oh, it's Nipper. Okay, that's cool. Oh, he's so mad. Owned. Good try, though, Nipper. Good try. In the shell we go, and I love the music in here. Ah, that's so cool. I love that they do that. This is such a clever game in every aspect. And a bunch of jerks. Okay, stop. Get owned. And die. What the? That was stupid. It bounced off the wall and into me. That was really dumb. And give it the jigsaw. Perfect. Look at me. I got my first jigsaw here in this world. I am awesome. Alright. Next thing. Get out of here. 
walk the entire length of the shell once again. That's okay. It's okay. I can deal. I can deal. Let's see, which way do I want to go now? Well, I can't do anything with that yet because I haven't unlocked it. That's alright. Hmm. Go over this way. Now oh, we got some more notes on the boat. And, oh, look, it's. Oh, I forget his name. Captain Blubber or something like that. Blubber Guts. I don't remember. Frick. Oh, you are such a cute sounding feather. Okay, how do I get that? Oh, that's right. I just climbed the pole for that one. Excuse me. I need to climb this. No, I don't want to talk to you. I need to climb this. Blubber. I lost my ship, but my ship crashed. We'll go find it then, Blubber Guts. And he talks in burps. Oh, it's just the best. This is why this game is so amazing. All right, up we go. Give me that. And no. Okay, how do I? Fine. Drop like that. There we go. Okay. And now we go down. Into the ship. Let's see. Drop down here. Let's go find his, like, treasure stuff. There's also a Kabokum token. Thing. And there's a treasure over there. There's also some notes. A is, like, the best way to swim through this because it's, like, super tight and cramped. And so, like, you just need to be, like, as steady as possible. There we go. Even the treasure talks! Gosh, this is amazing. LRB cancels speeches when they're on the screen. Is that so? Totally does. You are freaking right. Oh my goodness. Now I know. Alright, never have to worry about that again. Now, how do I get into the other area where the treasure is? I, 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 or do I, do I have to just swim over that? I think I actually do. Wait, hold on. Let me go back in here and reassess my situation. No, I can't get over there from that way. Where, how do I freaking get over to that treasure? I don't even know. I'll figure that out later. I'm not too concerned with it. Well, actually, I kind of am. Uh... Oh! Dot. Coming from the side. Stupid. Gosh. This is this is not my first time playing Banjo-Kazooie. I actually played Banjo-Tooie a several dozen times growing up. Just, just the sequel, though. Never played Banjo-Kazooie Banjo um, until... A about, I mean, I played it maybe for like a few minutes when I was little, but uh, like I never actually played it ex for a while until like about a year ago, and then, um, but I've never finished it, and I haven't really played it in s since a year ago, so I'm still kind of like new to it, and once you play Banjo-Tooie, it kind of throws this game off, because it's like, oh, it has, you know, the controls for Banjo-Tooie are already all the controls you've learned by the end of Banjo-Kazooie, so it's like... It just throws me off and all that, all that jazz. And just, it's just confusing. Give me the jiggy. And, okay, yes, have your treasure, sir. I love Banjo. I love these the series, but I don't know the, the first one as well. Nor have I ever been as fond of it as I have been of uh, Secret. Okay, so can I make that jump from here? No, I can't. All right, hi, Snacker. How are you doing, buddy? Oh, you're so frightening. He's gonna get me. Ah. Okay. There we go. So easy. Alright, so just hug this side and you can get the. Excuse me. Get the notes. Perfect. And the evil treasure chest of doom and destruction with the teeth. Get over that. And perfect. Don't actually. Okay, fine. Touch the teeth. I don't even care. It's what kills me. is just so good. It's like, it's probably my, it's one of my all-time favorite games, Banjo 2. It's, I love the game so much. And I, and actually, that's the whole point of me streaming this right now. Um, I want to go Let's Play it on my YouTube channel, or at least Banjo 2. -y. I don't really care to Let's Play this one, because I don't know it so well, so that's why I am actually deciding to stream it today. So it's like, you know, different, different content. This is a much easier way for me to play through a game if I haven't really, if I'm not really knowledgeable of it. Excuse me! Rude. Okay, crabs? I hate the crabs, seriously. Because I can never, like, gauge, like, my distance on them when I'm trying to attack them. Give me the notes, give me the honeycomb. Ugh, alright. Next thing. 
Don't worry about you. 